The German Constitutional Court could plunge Italy into further crisis in a ruling over the legality of the European Central Bank's coronavirus pandemic recovery package. The Karlsruhe-based court could determine how much support Italy's debt markets can draw from the bank's quantitative easing program. A no ruling from the court on Tuesday would take the eurozone into legally uncharted territory at a time when the European Union's single currency bloc is already teetering on the edge of collapse. While the ECB is not bound by German law, the Bundesbank, the central bank's largest shareholder, is. The ruling, due to be published on Tuesday, will decide whether the ECB's bond buying program can deviate from the so-called capital key. The key dictates purchases according to the size and population of each country. During the coronavirus crisis, the ECB has been buying Italian debt well above the pace set by its own rules. A ruling against the ECB's program would come as a serious blow to the central bank's efforts to support Italy and Spain through the pandemic. The EU's Frankfurt-based central bank was forced to loosen its rules after the outbreak to allow for additional bond buying to contain the financial impact of the coronavirus. Its €750 billion Euros scheme has eclipsed any previous asset purchasing program ever deployed to prop up the Eurozone economy. Christine Lagarde, the ECB's president, said there was no limits to our commitment to the euro when unveiling its rescue plans last month. In a statement, the ECB said all purchases shall be conducted in a flexible manner allowing for fluctuations in the distribution of purchase flows over time, across asset classes and among jurisdictions. Italy, Europe's worst hit country by the disease, has seen its economy suffer after its government enforced a lockdown to halt the spread of the virus. Last week Fitch ratings downgraded the Eurozone's third largest economy by a notch to BBB. This leaves Rome just one level above junk, meaning the country is at high risk from default. Prime Minister Giuseppe Conte's government has forecast just an 8% slump in GDP this year. However, economists at Bloomberg have predicted a more dramatic 13% drop in economic activity. The ECB has focused much of its bond buying in Italy in desperate hope of preventing a market rout. Last month the central bank claimed its program had a stabilizing effect on the market.